Hoik welcome newly promoted Harriets to Mansfield Park, looking to build on their narrow victory away to Edinburgh Rockies last weekend, whilst the struggling visitors arrived, still in the hunt for their first win of the season. After 15 minutes, fullback Kirk Ford put in a brilliant 50-22 kick, which gave Hoik a line-out in a very welcoming position. Sure enough, the Hoik Park put in a strong push and Nicky Little crashed over. Ford then converted from a difficult angle to put Hoik 7-0 ahead. Hoik then took firm control of the game over the next 20 minutes and scored a further three unanswered tries. First, Ross Graham crossed the whitewash for an unconverted try in the corner after Dalton Redpath had made a break from a driving mall. Ten minutes later, former Southern Knights player Andrew Mitchell ran over for a converted try, using his dancing feet to find his way around the Heriots players and to the try line. Just before half-time, another former Southern Knights player also scored for Hoik. This time, Dalton Redpath hit a nice line and cut through two defenders, diving over to give Hoik the try bonus right before the break. Into the second half, things were more competitive and Harriet's finally managed to get some points on the board when Oshin Quinn found space and ran in for a converted score on 50 minutes. However, it only took two minutes for Hoik to reply as prop Nicky Little grabbed his second try of the afternoon through another driving mall from the Mansfield Park forwards. Desperate to get back into the game, Harriet's managed to carve the Hoik defence open once again. This time, Craig Robertson finished off a nice box move for another converted Harriet's score. But the men from the couple struggled to keep their momentum going and soon they were standing under their own post once again as Jay Linton ran in for another converted score for the hosts. Hoik were then caught sleeping from the following kickoff as Harriet's quickly cancelled out the previous try by getting one of their own immediately after. Charlie Deneen putting them just one more score away from a try bonus point of their own. However, it was the home team who had the possession for the remaining 10 minutes and put a further 14 points on the board. First, replacement prop Tom Hope crossed the line from close range for a successfully converted try before Ronan McKean made a break in his own half and used his pace off the bench to power to the line. Kirk Ford converted once again. As full time blew around Mansfield Park and the sun fell over the surrounding hills, Hoik Vice Captain Andrew Mitchell picked up the newly created Norman Southern Memorial Shield, which these two teams will contest for from now on. On top of this, Hoik also now get their name on the Bill McLaren Shield and will take it to GHA next week looking for a similar performance. Full time at Mansfield Park, it's Hoik 52, Harriet's 21. Uh, obviously happy to, to get the victory. Uh, it was such a big score but obviously still little things to work on. We know the finished start call but i uh, extremely happy to get the result. Last year I think we, we let a few bonus points slip uh, and it hurt us towards the end getting into that home semi-final so if we can pick up as many as we can throughout the season we'll be quite happy. Fair play to edit some of the moves that were playing in the backs that were quite quite hard to defend but um, aye, we could probably improve on that so we'll be working on that and looking at that at training.